When you have a small room with an inward opening door centered in the wall, you lose a lot of valuable floor and storage space. There is an easy fix. Make it open outwards. I called in my mate Alex the Chippy to show us how it's done. First thing you need to do is look at the beading that the door closes against. If it's well centered in the frame, you're in luck. That makes this project a lot easier. Start by removing the screws from the hinge side that's attached to the frame. Leave one screw in the top of each hinge. Support the door and leaving the top until last, remove the remaining screws. Measure from the top of the door down to the top of the closed hinge on the door. Add 5mm to your measurement for clearance. Transfer that measurement to the frame measuring from the inside top down. Take one hinge from the door, hold in place at that mark with the hinge plate sitting flat and the rounded side flush with the frame. Mark the top of the hinge and mark and pre-drill for the top screw. Reattach the hinge to the door before lifting the door to align with your pencil mark and the screw hole, then add one screw. Adjust the door to align the bottom hinge with the frame, pre-drill and secure with one screw. Now add screws to all of the holes in the hinges. Test the door. It should close without binding against the frame or having any excessive gaps. Unscrew the catch plate from the other side of the door. Close the door and mark top and bottom where the bolt contacts the frame. Use your square to transfer those marks to the inside of the frame. If it's outside face against the frame, centre the catch plate on those two marks, mark the opening and the screw holes. Mark a vertical and horizontal line to find the approximate centre of the plate opening to find your point for drilling. Fit a 22mm spade bit to your drill centre its tip on that marked centre and bore a hole approximately 10mm deep. Check the position of your plate, right way round this time, pre-drill for screws and then screw the plate into place. Check closing and that the bolt takes to the catch plate. If you find the door is rattling, remove the catch plate and use a wide pair of pliers to gently bend the lug inside the opening in toward the centre a little bit. Refit and check again. Use a suitable filler to plug the old catch hole, you may need to do this in a few layers, and the screw holes. Allow to dry before sanding smooth and repainting, then you're done. Space reclaimed with a simple door flip.